Everyone, I think we should give a round of applause to whoever's behind the marketing on episode 9 because they've done a fantastic job at rowling up the fans while giving away nothing. Now before you is a plethora of many different tweets from two main actors in Star Wars, C-3PO and Luke Skywalker. Now, about two weeks ago, I posted this one right here, disappointed there was no Star Wars trailer shown during the Super Bowl. And basically, we have all, after two weeks, been left to feel like this dude right here, unfortunately. Since then, we have gotten many more tweets by Anthony Daniels, and mind you, they just keep getting more and more cryptic as we keep going. I mean, I feel like I'm reading a Lemony Snicket book or something like that. And all the while, Reddit, YouTube, Twitter, everything is just blowing up more with Episode 9 contemplations, theories, and different ideas of what the title or what it could be about. Heck, I'm even guilty of it. I'm posting things about Episode 9 that I have no clue about, and they're just theories. And look at the views. Everyone's obviously very interested. Any YouTuber who's posting anything about Episode 9, the views are just, just skyrocketing up because the hype is real. And this was their plan all along. They basically just told their two main actors to release some very cryptic information that really gives away absolutely nothing. But we got the marketing team pretty much looking like this dude right now, just sitting there. Everything is proceeding as... And all the while, us fans are just making Episode 9 even more hyped without getting anything in return. So, basically, we have been trolled pretty hard. And while this is obviously a bit unfortunate, it's a really genius move by the marketing team. Now, here's the good news. Basically, J.J. Abrams has posted that picture that I talked about in a video or two ago, that principal production is finished, which means that their filming is done, and now everything goes into post-production for episode 9. It means, you know, VFX and everything that has to be done to deliver the film on time in December of 2019. So this is where the fun begins, and that is exactly what the UK Star Wars Twitter has also posted this. The calm before the galactic storm. And they say this is where the fun begins. Where tons of fans are obviously very confused with what is going on. I mean, you guys can see for yourselves. But I mean, <laughs> yeah, this is literally see, this is literally what I'm talking about here. They pretty much just teased us like crazy, and they've done it in such a very charming and perfect way, where they have you know the actors themselves tweet things out that we're going to be getting something very soon, but we haven't gotten anything. And this has worked in their favor. Reddit's blown up with everything episode nine. I've even noticed it on my channel. Everything episode nine that I talk about has you know decent views compared to other things, which. I find actually more interesting, but nevertheless, if you are a Star Wars fanatic, chances are you're going to be interested about Episode 9, and I've said this from the day one at least, that I believe Episode 9 will be one of the most successful Star Wars movies at the box office because you have such a divided fandom right now, but that fandom, are you, sorry, my battery died, anyways, where was I? That fandom has a lot of passion, and with that passion, they're basically going to be either seeing it to love it, or seeing it to see if it sucks, because they already hate it. So with that being said, we've got pretty much everyone wanting to go and see it, and I think, I hope that Episode 9 will be very, very good. I mean, I'm a Star Wars fan, I don't want it to suck, like why, why would I, I don't, I don't want it to suck. So I hope they fix a lot of things that, you know, made fans unhappy with Episode 8, including myself, and I hope that uh, we're going to get an awesome, awesome movie. I believe we're going to get something very, very soon. I mean, at the very, very latest, and I really hope this is not the case, but we're going to be getting, obviously, a trailer or a title reveal or something like that by the time Celebration arrives, so sometime in April. Now, if we get it before that, that's awesome. That's great. I hope we're going to be getting something, you know, within the next week or so, but in the event that we don't, I just want you guys to know that this was their plan all along, and they've done a great job at it. It's obviously worked, because we're all racking our brains and going crazy with the Episode 9 hype. It has begun, my friends. So rest assured, we'll be getting something very soon now that Principal Production has wrapped. And if anyone is smart enough to basically decrypt these cryptic uh, tweets by Anthony Daniels, please comment below. Let me know. Let us all know. Post it to Reddit. I don't know. Wherever you want. But I hope we're going to be getting something soon. Let me know what you think of their amazing plot to rile up the fans like crazy without giving us anything and i will see you guys in the next episode of star wars theory thank you so much for watching hit like if you enjoyed this debunked whatever i don't i don't even know just hit like all right all right i will see you all in the next episode until then remember the force will be with you always now fulfill your destiny